Thanks for staying with us here on CBS News Chicago. I'm Marisa Vedra, and we continue to bring you interviews with the aldermanic candidates ahead of the April 4th municipal runoff election in the city of Chicago. Joining me now is Chicago Police Officer Peter Chico. He is running for alderman in the 10th Ward. Mr. Chico, thank you for being with us. Thank you. I want to start by asking why you want to be alderman. I want to be alderman because I come from a family of public service. Uh, my grandfather was the president of U.S. Steel Union, Local 65 in the 70s. Uh, my cousin is Gary Chico. My father is Illinois State Trooper. My sister and brother-in-law are Chicago police officers, as well as I am. So I come from a family of public service, and we believe in that in this family. What would you say is the number one issue right now in the 10th Ward as you see it, and what is your solution? Number one issue, like every other ward in the city, is public safety. Um, when I'm knocking on doors, going to community events, that's the one thing that uh, the residents bring up to me is they want to feel safer in their home. Um, the alderman's job is to build a relationship with the Chicago Police Department. I don't have to. I have one. Uh, so day one, we could hit the ground running, making our residents feel safe, um, allowing them to walk on the street, go to the local eateries, um, take the children to the park. That's, that's the number one issue. So Chicagoans voted out the incumbent mayor. We know that there's going to be an unprecedented number of city councilmen, uh, aldermen new to city council that could include yourself. I want to ask, does that newness shape the context of how you're looking at this position should you be elected? Um, I, I think it does. Um, it's going to, city council is going to have a different feel to it, obviously, and with the incoming new mayor. So the way I look at it is, um, we're going to form relationships with whoever the mayor is, work with the mayor to bring the 10th Ward residents um, what they deserve. Peter Chico, candidate for alderman in the 10th Ward. We appreciate you being here. Thank you. Thank you so much. Joining us now is the other candidate for alderman for the 10th Ward, Ana Guajardo. Ana, thank you for being with us. Thank you for having me. Tell us why you want to be alderman. Yes, I would love to be alderman to be able to represent the 10th Ward working families that I've been a part of for my entire career. Um, in community organizing, um, from when I co-founded a nonprofit here in the 10th Ward, from my union years of organizing, as well as, as I mentioned, the executive director. Our 10th Ward is a unique ward, and we have so much to do and so much to advocate, but I have the ability to listen, to act, to organize, and win for working families, and that is why I feel I am suited to be the 10th Ward elder woman. What would you say is the number one issue right now in the 10th Ward, and what is your solution? Public safety is the number one issue. We have seen, unfortunately, a lot of crimes that have been happening in the last several months. Um, we need to hire more detectives. We need to make sure that the police officers that are missing are also um, you know, in place. Uh -huh. We also have to advocate for more mental health services, more other resources for our children after schools. Um, we have to make sure that we have jobs in the community. But we also have to ensure, you know, that and need to expect that the police is able to do their job. And we have to end what I'm calling an open air drug market that's continuously happening in our community. So Chicago voters ousted the incumbent mayor. There's going to be an unprecedented number of new aldermen at city council. How does that newness at city hall shape the way you look at the job should you be elected? Yes, there's so many serious problems that we're having in the city of Chicago, from public safety crisis to the pandemic, our schools that are not fully funded, our pensions that are also underfunded. We are tired of the old school way of how Chicago has been functioning. We need to have new leadership, people who have the ability and the skills to be able to take on this position. And I'm able to bring in a lot of the work and my knowledge as I have done in the past 20 plus years of organizing. I'm very excited to be the next elder woman, and I'm ready to build relationships with the other 49 eldermanic persons that we have in our seat. Ana Guajardo, candidate for the 10th Ward Alderman position. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you for having me. Appreciate it. And be sure to stay with us here on CBS News Chicago as we bring you interviews with the candidates in the aldermanic runoff races ahead of the election on April 4th.